Hey everybody, Jake Arthur from Locked On Colts here. We continue today now with 90 days until the Colts week one kickoff. And with that, we bring to you a little bit about nose tackle Grover Stewart. This is a true success story for uh, general manager Chris Ballard. Drafted this guy in the fourth round of the 2017 NFL draft. He has steadily gotten better each year of his career to the point now where he's one of the premier nose tackles in the NFL. Uh, during the 2020 season, got a three-year $30 million extension, which brings us to now. He's going to be eligible for another one, uh, so it could be another big payday coming his way. Really, no matter the defensive coordinator, this guy has excelled. Ted Monachino, uh, Matt Eberflus, now Gus Bradley. Stewart is just getting better all the time, and he is in his prime. Uh, coming off a career year, 70 tackles, again, for nose tackle, that's quite a bit. Four sacks, I think seven tackles for loss. Uh, this guy is just putting up career numbers. Again, starting to creep up into the numbers that you see from a three-tech. Uh, DeForest Buckner, of course, gets all the love on the Colts' defensive line. McGrover Stewart is arguably just as critical. Uh, it's really hard to make an argument one way or another. Uh, but regardless, Stewart has been a terrific player for the Colts. Uh, arguably the heartbeat of that whole defensive line. You really can't have the success against the run that the Colts have had in the last few years without a guy like that right in the middle. So uh, big things ahead for Stewart. You know, maybe another big contract coming his way as well. So stay tuned to HorseshoeHuddle.com and Locked on Colts here for more on this countdown to the Colts kickoff. Again, this is Jake Arthur. Thanks.